My coworkers and I feel very much at danger when we go into our work area. Not only are we worried for our safety, but we're also worried that we're going to work a 16 hour day because there's not very often that we can go home after our shift and it's not because of people calling in sick, it's because there are holes in our schedule, meaning that there is nobody scheduled to work. So people are being mandated to stay. Lack of sleep and stress makes it hard to deal with our families at home, makes it hard to deal with our patients because when you're being called names or you're being spit at, it's hard to say, I, I understand that you're upset. Can I help you? So you want to be appropriate in speaking with them so that you don't get them more angry and um, be able to have a good conversation with them so you can calm them down. And it's hard to stay calm when you're scared. I've had my glasses busted. I've been punched in the face, so I guess I have been hurt. I, I like the Band-Aid because it's a, it reminds me that you know everybody gets injured at my job. Last Friday, I had, to, I had a patient jump the desk just for a piece of nicotine gum. And I had to turn around and run and lock myself into the medication room. So, you know, and that was scary. I was in there shaking. But then when I came out, it was like, okay, now I gotta face this patient and be um, nice and pretend like nothing happened so that he doesn't get upset. We can do it though because we're well trained and um, by our other co-workers letting us know, you know, you did good or are you okay? I chose this profession because I enjoy working with this type of clientele. It's like a family member, really. The patients, you know, they call you by your names because they know you. They miss us when we're gone, I know that. Some of our patients are violent and have aggressive problems. We used to be able to escort them to their rooms or to a, a quiet area so that they could get out of the environment that they're in to calm themselves down and now we can't put them anywhere because it's restricting them. So some people have thought of having a chill out room. They could go in there if they were angry and relax and be calm. We want management to listen to our ideas. 